Hey guys, it's Stacy here. Today I'm sitting in the park next to my house. I hope you guys can hear me well because it's very, very windy. Even though I have my microphone and my camera, I also have another external microphone here just in case the one on the camera doesn't work very well. So I just want to make sure that you guys can hear me uh, through this uh, wind. It's a beautiful place here. I'm sitting uh, in the park next to my house and there's a lot of people today enjoying the weather because it's really beautiful. Uh, even though it's windy, it's not that cold. I am, of course, wearing a little jacket here. But anyway, let's talk about what I want to talk about, which is a bullying. I always wanted to understand why some people take pleasure in bullying someone else. Or should I say, people taking pleasure in making others miserable because that's what bullying is all about my goodness this is really windy um, I always wanted to understand I have a little theory about the bullies they are those ones who basically have nothing better to offer and they will actually do whatever they can in order to draw your attention and the only way they have to draw your attention is just by hurting you because basically the people who actually um, are victims of bullying they are in my opinion special people because they are the ones who whenever they arrive in a place they will always draw attention of everybody for any other reason and just because you draw attention of people doesn't mean that you should see that as a negative thing Maybe you draw attention because you're beautiful. Too beautiful, you have a different kind of beauty. Maybe you draw attention because you deign to be different from others. And that should not be seen as a, uh, a handicap. Uh, you should not feel threatened by the fact that you are different. And just because you're different and some people cannot take that, uh, doesn't give them the right to um, torment you, to uh, bully you, to uh, cause you pain. So trying to understand why some people would take pleasure in doing that, uh, I just came up with a theory that maybe uh, bullies are just insecure people. That uh, just because I think that worse than being bullied is actually being ignored by everyone around you. And that's basically, in my opinion, what bullies are. They are people who have nothing better to offer you and they just feel the need to draw attention in some way. And one of the ways they have to draw attention is just uh, by tormenting someone and trying to make themselves look better than the victim. And unfortunately, most of the victims of bullying they tend to become withdrawn and they tend to start believing that someone is bullying them because they have a problem. But basically, the ones who have a problem are the ones who are bullying you, the ones who are tormenting you. Because if you are happy with your life, if you are always busy with something that you enjoy, that you think is worth your while, why would you even waste your time to torment someone else? So if you are a victim out there and you think that you are less than the person that is bullying you, please stop. Stop thinking like that because you're not. You're not less than anybody else, let alone a bully who is, in my opinion, someone so unhappy with himself and with his own life that he has nothing else to offer but, you know, pain. And it's kind of sad when you actually think about that. It's really sad, someone living their life like that. So basically, this is the message that I wanted to pass on to you. Uh, if you are a victim uh, of bullying, of someone who's been tormenting you because they think they're better than you are, uh, stop thinking like that because you're so much better than that and it's not like uh, encouraging you to feel like you're better than anybody else because we are not better than anybody else we are just as good as anybody else so what I want you to think and to remember is that no one has the right to make you feel bad 
no one has the right to uh, treat you as if you are doing something wrong just by being you and the moment you start understanding that the one who's been tormenting you is actually the one who feels threatened by you that will give you a little bit more strength to fight back and when I say fight back I don't mean like uh, using your uh, physical strength or just like uh, um, um, bad words you don't have to do that sometimes you just have to find the strength to ignore someone who does not deserve your time and your energy uh, everybody has their own ways of dealing with a bullying but I think one thing that everybody should do is actually uh, always a report uh, if you are being tormented by someone, I think you have not only the right, it's your duty to report that person because someone like that should not just be uh, walking around making somebody else's life uh, miserable because that is simply not right. So if you are in that position, just, uh, you know, remember that you are so much more than just a victim. You are someone who actually has the power to educate people and you are someone who has the power to stop anyone from tormenting you because the moment you realize that you are not less than them, you will find that courage in you because that's the one thing that you have. So that's my message for today. I hope you guys uh, like that. If you, you can always, if, just just feel free to uh, let me know what you think about that and um, um, yeah I think that's basically what I wanted to say so on this beautiful afternoon I am going to enjoy the day because it's my day off tomorrow I have to go back to work and just like you I have to fight every single day against uh, people who see me as less than they are people who think they have the right to feel like I am not worth it and um, I've learned that I am worth it and you should feel that way too because after all we are all worth it so big kiss have a wonderful day if you have any questions if you have any comments feel free to leave them in the comments below thank you so much for watching and you guys have a fabulous day bye Thank you.